we are going to calculate factorial of 4 which is 24 but the answer would be available at compile time you don't have to run this program to get 24 and this is the syntax we will give this factorial's value will be depending on this 4 minus 1 which is 3's value so for that you have to create another struct so it will create it at compile time and then the moment it reaches to 0 meaning we will keep on doing this n minus 1 for the time till we reaches 0 and this is kind of a terminating condition when the factorial is 0 the value is actually 1 now this will go back and this will get updated that's why if i will run this answer is 24 and with the help of Godboard, we can verify that this 24 is available at compile time only. If I will change this 4 to let's say 5, then this number will change. See, now it is 120. So this is template metaprogramming. You are watching CPP Nuts video series. For more videos like this, do consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next videos guys. Bye bye, take care.